Hi, this is Steve Knight and welcome to Blackwell Global's daily market update. Starting with the euro dollar and the currency pair proved to be one of the strongest of the day, its traders are increasingly looking towards a QE taper in the coming months. Subsequently, the pair rallied strongly, rising around 70 pips to close the session out around the 1 spot 1420 mark. The rally saw price action extending above the 100 hour MA and towards last week's high at 1 spot 1445. Moving forward, all eyes will be upon the US non-farm payroll results, which are forecast to come in around the 178k mark. <clears throat> Turning to the cable now, and the pair managed to find a modicum of support and rise to close the session around 35 pips higher at 1 spot 29.69. The support primarily came from a speech from BOE member McCafferty, who added the weight of his voice to the Hawks by suggesting that he sees moderate rate rises over the medium term. This saw the cable moving above the 100 hour MA, but it will remain to be seen if it holds. Moving forward, watch for the UK NISA GDP estimate, which is due out shortly and likely to impact the pair. Finally, shifting to the dollar franc, and the pair fell during the session to close around the spot 9602 mark. The downshift has now taken price action to the south side of the 100 and 200 hour MAs and could be the start of a broader technical breakdown if it now moves below the supporting trend line. The bearish swing even managed to overshadow the negative Swiss CPI figures, which fell to negative 0.1% month on month. On the news front, keep a close watch on the US non-farm payroll figures which are due out shortly. Well that's all I've got for you today, this is Steve Knight with Blackwell Global, thanks for watching.